online today, and we also have our great and excited in studio audience. Yeah. Bringing the energy. I love it. And over on the couch is our awesome What's Trending panel. He's the editor-in-chief of Make and the co-founder of the popular blog, Boing Boing. It's Mark Fraunfelder. <laughs> He's starting TV shows like Weeds and No Ordinary Family, as well as movies like Baby Mama and The 40-Year-Old Virgin. Romney Malko. <laughs> and letting us know what all of you are thinking throughout the show, it's Melissa June Rowley. Thank you, darling. Yes, I'd love to bring you into the conversation, so please join us in the chat room by tweeting us at What's Trending using hashtag WTLive. Do it. Thank you, everyone. Well, Mark, you're a legendary DIY guy. So what's something that you've made recently that you want to share with all of us? Sure. Well, I make a lot of different things, but uh, one of the things that I've been working on for a while now is uh, my wife likes to buy this kind of, you know, that organic peanut butter where it separates yeah. you know, the oil at the top and the... And you stir stuff. it and oil gets all over it's and I ruin my vanessa. shirts and everything. Yeah. So I've made this device that rotates the peanut, bar, peanut butter jar 180 degrees every 24 hours so that the oil slowly seeps to the top. This yeah, is, so then you have oh a well-mixed peanut butter. This is why you gotta live with a geek. Yo, can you make one human size so I can get some blood to my brain? <laughs> like I can split me a brain. <laughs> that would be, be awesome. awesome. You can yeah. sleep like that. And you also have this book, Made by Hands. That's right. Congratulations, yep. everyone. Check it out. So what's That's this all about? Uh, that's about my, my, my kind of my quest to become a maker. You know, after hanging out with all these people in Make Magazine, these makers who make these incredible robots and rockets and race cars, I wanted to start doing that myself. So I started doing things like raising chickens, uh, becoming a beekeeper here in LA, making cigar box guitars, uh, working with Arduino microcontrollers and all that kind of stuff. And it was, you know, just kind of chronicling my failures and successes in that world. A lot wow. of fun. Wow, very That's cool, inspiring. I need is. to do more. No doubt. Like, <laughs> all right, Romani, Yo. tell us about your new role in Good Wife. Yeah, like, it's kind of serendipitous. I was like, you know, I'm thinking, I think I'm ready to kind of move to New York. You know, I was born there. And, all and it's of a, sudden, a huge show. It so is a huge show. And it's my favorite show. And all of a sudden, I get this phone call. It's like, yo, they want you to be on Good Wife. You know, come roll out and do something for like four or five episodes. And I'm like, serious? So I was like, hell yeah. And um, it's, I play like this uh, pro bono attorney. Mm -hmm. And I don't want to give away too much because there is a huge shocker involved in, in my role. But anyway, um, yeah, it's, it's, it's the, in my opinion, it's the best show on TV. Yeah, yeah. No, that's amazing to be part of that. And then on the other hand, end of things, you have this crazy character, yes. Tijuana Jackson. Tijuana Jackson. I, I'm downstairs complaining to like, you know, your team trying to figure out how does Romney Malco get more subscribers and followers than Tijuana Jackson? Because Tijuana Jackson is just like, it's a, it's a character that I play. He's an ex-convict turned motivational speaker, right? And he just has this way. That's amazing. Yeah, he's got this way with words, and I think people just like him more than they like me. Like, he'll say stuff like, you know, you ain't going to get laid by saying certain things. You're going to get laid by saying things a certain way, heard me? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> but the, that is the, awesome. The joke is people don't know it's me. See, I have these, uh, my dentist made these teeth for me, and they look real. So people are usually thinking Tijuana Jackson is a completely different person. They call him. You know, we're talking about how they were doing this, um, your, your therapy online. Yeah. TJ's been doing that for 11 years over Skype. <laughs> I'm telling you. You're this. advanced technologically. It's not me, it's well, TJ. He's very tech-tech. Yeah. It's TJ. Well, speaking of being technologically advanced, 